So when you're using your regression line, so here are some data points, here's my regression line, um, you've got to be a little bit wary about which values you are using. And by that, I mean which x values you're using to predict your y values. Okay, so remember the data points are showing you what the data has, the data that has been collected. Okay, so I can only really use any x values up to the last data point that is collected on the right and down to the last data point that is collected on the left. Okay, so I can use any x value between there and there, and I would refer to that as interpolation. So any of these x values between those two, I can go up to the line and then get my predicted y value. That's perfectly fine. Um, and that should be reasonable. Okay. If you choose any values that are outside of this, so if I choose a value over here, and I go up to my line and use it, then it may well be that it gives you an accurate prediction, or it might not. Okay, the problem is it's unreliable once it is outside of those ranges. And we refer to that as extrapolation. So it's extrapolation there. And it's extrapolation there. Okay. While well, it's interpolation in the middle. Now, the reason why, uh, once you go beyond your final data point as to why it might not be appropriate, is because if you continued uh, collecting your data, you don't know whether something like this starts to happen. Okay, what if it does something like this while your regression line is shooting off up that way, but actually past that point, it kind of the data starts to tail off. So you don't know whether that's going to happen or not. And it may well be past this point, if you go over here, it's completely unphysical. Okay, so that's what we mean by interpolation, extrapolation. And sometimes we're asked, um, if I use this x value, um, how reliable would it be? Okay, so the discussion along those lines is, is it interpolation, is it extrapolation, would you deem that as reliable or unreliable, and why?